Hey there. So last week we talked about contracting a property and woohoo, let's pretend like you got it. So now we're talking about next steps from here, getting that escrow deposit over to the title company is of most importance. When we wrote that offer and presented it to the seller, we included a number and that number is what you're committing to deposit with the title company and usually within three days of going into contract. The easiest way to think about it is this is your good faith money. This is you telling the seller that, hey, I have every intention of moving forward with this contract from start to finish doing my parts, following through with my obligations within this agreement. And if I don't, then you may have a right to this money. That's really what it sums up to. My goal as your agent is to protect that with every fiber of my being. <laughs> you will know your deadlines. You will know the consequences. You will know the, like, if we're coming up on a deadline and, and no action is taken on your part, you'll know what's coming. Like, there are no surprises. And I also don't want you to lose money. So, you have this um, this commitment to get it to title, and the money is negotiable. Some sellers have a set number when they put their listing on the market. They say, we want to see at least this much in escrow. Some sellers don't have that, but you may want to go in strong. It all depends on the situation. So if it's multi-offer, this doesn't really enhance what the seller is going to put in their pocket once we close. It just tells them that you're putting more skin in the game, right? And when we close, what happens to that money? That's the big question. When we close on the property, that money comes back to you. It goes towards your closing costs, your down payment, whatever you have, it goes towards it at closing. If of course you choose to default on your contract, then I am going to wish you the best. I have never had a buyer uh, lose their escrow. So there's that, take it for what it is. You need to have a good agent who is going to protect that and help you understand your obligations. So you know I'm there from, it, from start to finish and beyond. If you're ready to talk about the buying process in more detail, give me a call, text, email, whatever works for you. My contact information's in the comments and I'm happy to connect. Take care.